There you go. All right, give it a throw, hard as you can. Nice. Especially for Dude, a grown-up. it's big, Zachary, it's a chair. Oh my it's God. It's a chair, Zachary. It's a chair. <laughs> <laughs> I never thought oh, I knew. That's so funny. So we'll try the magnet too. Yeah. yeah, I have a weird feeling that when it generated in the lake, maybe something's in there that we don't know about. Yeah. We well, couldn't figure out what that says or what that means or... They did. What's up, guys? What's up, guys? <laughs> I'm here with Zach. It's Phil, obviously. Another day, another Randonautica video. We are at Pratt Farm again. Zach always wanted to do is Randonautica, so we're going to do some Randonautica. Then we're going to do some magnet fishing. See, he's already one step ahead of me. Then we're going to do some magnet fishing. Um, we were just over by the tree that was in the last... Um, actually, not last episode, but last time I was here... Um, you know, the girl was standing in front of the tree, yeah, left the fruit, very strange. What? Oh, we did find these rocks. Hold on two seconds, we'll show you. Okay. Yeah, so there's also these rocks. I don't know if she left them here or not. But also on the other side, also there's this. We what? couldn't figure out what that says or what that means or if it means anything. Also, we come around this side. Looks These honestly look like... Um, I think she is some demon over there. <laughs> I think more so... Uh, which I'm gonna call it. I think these are like, um, like yeah, prayer stones or like those like stones that girls, I would say always girls, men sometimes men use or whatever. Like spiritualist people, oh. they believe that like stones carry power or whatever. So like, one stone is good luck for money and I don't know whatever. I'm not too like, familiar with this. Like this would make stuff, sense but. if this was like the money one. Yeah. This would make sense if this is. They like do the have little things on them. This one has like a name, and then like a number or something. I don't know what that is. B R something. It looks like a number nine. Oh, what's this? Uh, that's trust. A, that's suspicious. It says trust. Um, Interesting, huh? Weird. I'm a... Strange though. I don't know what they are. But anyway, we're gonna pull up random. We're gonna. Um, show, I'm gonna show Zach the app, and then uh, we're gonna do our first point. All right. One thing we did want to mention, right? We were. Oh, I opened up the random Nautica app. And we were standing over there by that tree. I tried to claim my daily tokens. And then it said, we already claimed our daily tokens. And he we did, did not. not. So, and then it was running, it was running really slow. You saw it, right? Yeah. Running really slow. I literally came maybe like 20 feet over here, opened it back up. App's working fine. Everything's fine. I literally had to buy things, buy tokens because it wouldn't let me, uh, wouldn't let me get my free ones. So that's fun. But anyway, we got our first point. And what was our intention? Paranormal. He picked it. He wanted paranormal. We got paranormal. He's got a stick. What, what did you what did you say about your, the stick? It's the... What is it called? A baton. A baton. It's the baton from the first episode or like yeah. the second, I think? Second or... The yeah. second. Yeah. yeah got it from the, the in the Huckamuck Swamp where he's bringing it with us for protection just in case. But anyway, let's go. The wraith is um, also known is actually one of the very well-known SCPs known as SCP-096. I think. At least I think. That's what you've seen online? That's what I've seen. That's, not, that's what I've heard online. Yeah, I've heard of breaks before in paranormal world. Oh, uh, well, there's this game that I've watched that YouTube play. Mm -hmm. And instead of, like, what I know, what I've seen the rake look like, it's like, like these weird claw hands and, like, this yeah, giant yeah, creature. Yeah, yeah. Like, no eyes. Yeah. But it's really good with hearing like, but that's like, that's like games version of Right, right. And I, I'm not even sure if they're real or not. I have no idea. I've never seen one. There's also this thing called the ghoul. Which, ghoul, yep, which sure. I, Old school. Like, it's like, a, the ghoul kind of reminds me of like a rake. Like, there's this right. video where this person here's like, who's, he's like in the bathroom. Mm -hmm. He hears tapping on his roof. He goes outside to investigate it. It's like this, this. It's the rake. I call. I thought it was the rake, but it turns out from this video I saw, you're like it's called the Mr. Mr. Incredible becoming uncanny meme, and it's like the monster you saw in Google was one of them. Mm -hmm. and it's the same exact creature I saw in that video. Weird, huh? And like these people who react to these videos try to like prove, like they try to like recreate it. Yeah. To yeah. see if it's like to prove if it's like real or not mm -hmm. and most of them they're pretty good at recreating so yeah 
So most of them are probably fake. If they aren't good at recreating it, right? We all know what that means. Yeah, exactly. Whoever that person was, the next day they go to sleep. They did. The person who recorded the video for them to check out. Mm-hmm. Next day, they did. <laughs> if, if they proved it to be real. Right. I'm already doing bad, bad vibes. Oh, really? Yeah, like I have like this weird sense sometimes. I feel like... Like a sixth sense. Like, not not even entirely, but like, yeah, mm-hmm. somewhere. Like I have, I have a sen- sense that, like a kind of sixth sense that goes off when I like feel weird and strange and it's soft. Uh, Starting to get up the walk a little bit. Hmm. That sixth sense, though, is powered by my uh, amygdala, the part of my brain. Oh, interesting. It's the oh. alarm in your brain. That's when I feel. Paranormal stuff happens when it's like dark. See, that's what most people think, but honestly, I've seen it happen many different types of times at dark. In the well, morning, during the day, in the middle of the day. For me, paranormal, if you're like thinking of like paranormal and haunted together, I'm completely... People I'm mostly par- think of nighttime and haunted houses like, and stuff like I that. What I feel like haunted is like anytime. I think of paranormal and haunted two separate things. Like haunted can be like at any time of the day. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like paranormal is mainly for night. Oh, interesting. But if you think about it, Silent Head is a paranormal thing. And people say that it comes out in day and night. So technically, now I have my point proven wrong. <laughs> so fun fact, the last two times I was here, the first time I was here, I had my first point was down that way. The last time I came here, when I found those pants, I went that way too. This time, it's taking us this way. Sus. Interesting. What was your intentions for the, the lo- That other- one, I think it was paranormal, actually. No, no, something lost. Yeah, I was my intention for that one. For the second time. You came. Oh, oh, the first time. Oh man, I don't remember the first time. The first time. It's dogs. I oh, this think- tree fell. This wasn't like that before. Oh, uh, nah. crazy. Wait, did we have any storms recently? Really? Um, I don't know. I'm trying to remember. I, I, I think the other day it was there was a thunderstorm or something, but. Maybe a little bit of wind, but I didn't. I don't remember. Wait, I don't think wind's strong enough to knock down that big of a tree. Yeah. Ma- imagine our paranormal anomaly. Uh, uh, how do you say that word? Anomaly. Anomaly is Bigfoot. I've done that's that why, before, yeah. And that's why all these trees are knocked oh, down. Oh yeah, right. <laughs> it's like Bigfoot's like rages, and he's like knocked down ah, a tree. Yeah. Like every time Bigfoot rages. And, or Siren Head, you're odd, you're odd to find not falling down trees. Is very high. And and that's what, and that's what only if like you're looking for Siren Head, mm-hmm. Bigfoot, that's what you're odd to see. But if you're looking for a Bigfoot, and you see really like really really big feet, like forty feet tall trees broken down, you you know you've entered the wrong forest. Mm-hmm. You've entered Siren Head forest. Siren Head. All right, guys, we're getting close to our point. It's going to be up ahead, straight a little bit, and then to the left. Oh, look at this. I always like these. Like, let's check out this forest. Isn't that oh cool? Oh, my God. Isn't that cool? There's a couple areas like that in here. There's this one, and then you know that other pathway I showed you? That, there's another area just like oh. this. I don't know if these are planted on purpose or if they're just wild, but it is kind of cool looking. Yeah, there's more down here. Yeah, so I think, actually, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so the pants are down this way. Before, I had went that way, and I looped back around this way and came out over here, I think. So either way, we went when we came back. Yeah, well, it's coming up ahead, actually, if they're still there. Yeah, then we got to go left. All right. So, hmm? I just bought this for, um, yeah, you want me to? Yeah, I'll, I'll put down my bag real quick. Yeah, so those jeans, the last time I was here, they're not here anymore. I don't see them at least. Oh, no! They were right here. Like hanging on that. So they're gone. Interesting. And this wasn't here before either. What, the rocks? Yeah, the, the rocks. Big, the, the big... These either. 
It's just weird. Not sus. that it means anything. Just sus. Yeah. <laughs> Mad sus. Why people be sus? Well, there's a bottle of uh, alcohol out here, I think, or Jack Daniels. Yeah, Jack Daniels. The worst place to be drunk. No right. One reason why. Teen. It's definitely teenagers. Because kids, you know, kids, go, you know, because they're not allowed to drink, so they'll usually come to places like this. And... All right, hold on. I'm just going to put away his baton. We're going to check the map and see did. if we got to go that way. I already did. Oh, you already did. Okay, cool. All right, let's see. Looks like this is just going to go straight. We'll keep on going. We'll see if where it leads. Imagine Never... we just go this way and it like, goes that way, but then it works right back around to where we were. <laughs> I was like, yeah, just the same trail. Yeah, they do have different names. This looks like it's gonna go to the left, so. Yeah, yeah, exactly. A little bit of exercise. Here. All right, guys, so we arrived at our point. We're really close. We're, we're it's, the GPS is being a little slow, so I'm pretty sure we're at the point. Um, obviously, we don't see anything. We, we're not even sure if we're still on Pratt Farm property, which we might not be. Um, but yeah, nothing, no objects at least. Um, nothing weird's happened so far. Um, yeah. Yeah, right. Alright guys, so we got a next intent. Um, hidden treasures is going to be our intent. It's down on the other side of the river from where we parked. There is a trail back there, so I know we can get back that way. So we'll go do that right now. I'll film a little bit of the walk over. And we'll go from there. Have another bridge. A different bridge. Uh, yeah, cool, I feel huh? like the rivers like get mocked up, but then there's like a mm -hmm. Yeah, right? Like, really that is cool. Really cool. Wow. It's like a little I pond. Think, I think that's like where the river goes. Where it like runs off, yeah. It's a big tree. Wow, that's a big tree that fell. Look at this one, huh? So know, big. I don't know why, but I always say my season and allergies are in spring. Yeah. But when they're busy, it's because they have the fall. Right. Spring, summer. I just say it's those two, but literally, it's any time when they're taller. Fall is actually also included, I think. Mm -hmm. I literally only say my season and allergies are in spring, because that's like when I'm mostly doing that. Right. And coughing and my throat's dry and stuff. Yeah, yeah. But otherwise, most of the time, like in Oh, summer, wow. Look at this one, huh? Not too bad. Look at that tree just fell right over. Oh, oh it's the pond, I think. Yeah, yeah, yep. Is that the pond where, like, the side was? I think so, or somewhat near it, yeah. Yeah, we're near the beginning. Crazy, huh? A bunch of trees falling down in here. Yeah. <laughs> uh, is that a goose? It's the Loch Ness Monster. Let me see what that Document is. Document the Loch Ness Monster. I don't know what that is. A mallard, maybe? Some sort, maybe of, some sort of duck? It's definitely in the duck family. Oh, what's this? Hmm. Looks like it could be like a yamaka. Uh oh. Oh, there he is. I didn't even see you there for a second. That's a huge tree, huh? Yeah. That's awesome. I was gonna like say, like, I was gonna try and like prank you and like go up here and go behind here and be like, Bill, help me! I'm being <laughs> killed by a ghost! A ghost trying to kick me! <laughs> but I decided not to. Look what I found. That. I found like a. I don't know what it is. Sus. Weird, right? Wait, let me. Let my. Seven. Seven. Sense. My one of my senses. Six, six sense? No. This is the sense of smell. You know what it smells like? What? It smells sus. Hmm. Everything I see is usually sus. You think? Wow, look at this tree, huh? Oh my jeez. Stand next to it, you can see how big uh, it is compared to you. Okay. Holy moly, look at that. Wow, huh? What a monster tree. Bunch of trees falling down in here, huh? 
Yeah, right. Maybe it might be right. What if, uh oh. Uh, All right, we're gonna have to be careful here, buddy. No. Oh, cheapers. All right, it's good. Just be careful over here. Watch this. There you go. You got it. I have boots, so I can just go right through. I I can be like Jesus, but not exactly. Like I can just walk <laughs> on the mud, like. I love it. All right, so our point's somewhere in there. Obviously, we're not gonna be able to get into there because we don't want to get ticks, right? Yeah. No ticks. Yeah. But um, we did find that piece of cloth. Um, looked kind of like a yarmulke. I don't know what it was. It, could that be our hidden treasure? I don't know. I don't know. We're just gonna walk back. Yep, now we're gonna walk back. <laughs> yeah. I still actually have capturing the real spider hedge. Duck down, duck down, duck down. Oh, okay, this is where the post is. I've been here before. Oh, okay. Sure. All right, guys, we're almost, we're pretty much at our point. We found this. We actually found something. Um, Bug on it. Kind of like a basketball, like a... but it's like shaped very oddly. Obviously, it has a hole in it, too. There's no way it's an actual basketball because yeah. it would like just be flattened. Yeah, like definitely weird. That's definitely, um, we actually found something, so that's cool. Like I said, a quarter of the time where you go out and play Randonautica, you don't find anything. But um, we actually found something. That's cool. Cool, huh? That's why it's more easier to see. Oh, yeah, definitely. Easier to walk across, too. Yeah, Boy Scouts, right? Yep. Troop 20. Cool. Sounds like the ocean, kind of. The different carvings. Different names. RJ. R plus J. Let's see. FNB. Wait, wasn't it like a boy camp or? Um, it was a farm. These are probably just like people, obviously, obviously most of these are teenagers. TS plus JS with a heart. Why would they have the same initials? Initials, that is weird. Brother, sister? <laughs> um, yeah, right? Hope not. Here, this, this is a new one. Cousins. MB plus SI567. Hmm. Or 27. Or is it X10? 11, 20, I don't know what that means. 2011. 2000, ah, uh, that can't be. That's too fresh for 2011. Hmm. Interesting. Little symbols. Well, if this used to be a farm, it was probably really, really old. Yeah, some of them might be, yeah. Definitely. The one with the um, JS and the TS. TS, yep. I probably win. Jennifer and Tyler. That's it. I'm that just was, guessing. Yeah, that they probably, that two probably weren't teenagers, though. They probably had been one. Yeah, maybe. I wonder if they're still together. That is if they're alive. That's true. You never know. Because you don't know how old they are. Right, right. It could, be, it could be really old. It could be from the revolution. Oh, who knows? You never know. Uh, I think it's frogs. Not. And there's dog doo They just passed some dog doo Unbelievable. People don't pick up their dog's poop. No respect. It's nature. <laughs> like, like, wolves are basically part of the dog family. Yeah, canines. Yeah, canines. So, don't not expect there to be dog poopy. It's basically just like, basically just like a wolf poop in mm -hmm. the forest. Like, right, or a coyote, I suppose. Yeah, because those are part of the canine family. Mm -hmm. Again, I'm not here at home. I feel like something like it sound, like like the sounds remind me of like Siren Head. But we don't know, that could be a guys helping. I'm I'm where I live, I'm more here than making those sounds at night. Mm hmm But we're almost yep. here. Yep, and in the beginning again. Well we are here. You know what's so weird? I've what? been here. Three times now playing Randonautica, right? Uh -huh. Never, ever, ever has Randonautica ever gave me a point down that way. It's always been this way, which is weird. Very strange. Right, let's go back in the car. Go in the car, yeah. and what are we going to do next? Magnet fishing. That's right. Yeah, we changed our plan instead of doing it, going to a more haunting place. Yep, that's right. Because we're going to eat then, because then we don't have to, you know... 
do all of yeah, that. Yeah, walk around and all that kind of stuff. We'll just... Without energy. Yeah, Wait. exactly. We have to go down here and make sure the brake's not under Sure, let's do it. You never know, you know? Are you down here? Like, are you down here, sir? Oh, he's not down here. No, he's not in. I wanted to interview him. It's so bad. Unbelievable, you know? Who knows what he's doing? Yeah, that's true. We did see a bunch of fallen trees, didn't we? You know, Bigfoot maybe. Who knows? You never know. All right, cool, guys. All right, we're going to go to the car. We're going to check ourselves the ticks before we get in there. And then next time you see us, we'll be doing magnet fishing. Um, that's the name of it, isn't that weird? Yeah, it sounds like, don't touch this pond or you're getting car frustrated. That's right. Like that. Um, so, um, I'm gonna let him do the first throw, so I'm just gonna turn the camera around and we'll get going. Busy, so oh, you know, I missed your first throw, but... Let's see, we got anything on here? Just a couple rocks, nothing too crazy. You want, you want to throw it again? Get up to the shoreline if you want. Get a little closer. And watch out, you got the, the rope on your foot. There you go. All right, give it a throw, hard as you can. Nice. Yeah, maybe. Oh, what do we got? Some seaweed, anything else on there? No, I think just seaweed. Yeah, uh-huh. Yep. Yeah. I love it. Day of first. All right, let me uh, give this a good toss out there. Look at that, guys. Look I at that it. throw. That's like far. That's pretty far. That's far that I can do. Well, that's because you're a grown up. Nick yeah, I'm East a little, I'm Coast. Definitely grown up. Definitely older. Oh, got to call. We got something, dude. You got to call Nick East Coast. I think we got something, man. Oh, did he text me? No, he's calling you. Is though. he? Dude, I think we got something, man. Yeah. Look at that, guys. Look how slow that's pulling me. We got something. There. Especially for Dude, a grown-up. Dude, it's big. Zachary, it's a chair. Oh, my it's God. It's a chair, Zachary. It's a chair. <laughs> <laughs> I never thought oh, I... Dude, that's so funny. <laughs> that's... Dude, this is my first chair. <laughs> Pretty cool here. Let me, uh, I'll take over for you. Oh, my God. How cool, huh? Oh, my God. It's a chair. <laughs> uh, guys, it's a chair. That is too funny. That is hilarious. Hi. Oh, dude, there's a uh, there's a, a thing on here. Look too, a little um, fishing hook. You know what I mean? One of those like fake fishes has a little hook on it. It's, it's it actually not that bad. It actually looks kind of new. You can you can smell the uh, the pond on it though, huh? All right, let me hey, just get this off. Put the car camera on mm -hmm. this. Yeah. <laughs> Just be careful. That's what fishes be like, though, honestly. <laughs> what, do you think it still folds open? We should just, like, take it out there. Like, anything we find, we should just, like... Like, I don't know why magnet It still works! It literally would still work. We'll, we'll let it dry out, but that's too funny. Holy moly. First honestly, first throw, honestly, Zachary. Just keep it there. Yeah, like, we'll leave it here. We'll just leave it there. Like, a hundred years later, I, like, 20 years later, I come back. I remember that chair. <laughs> Too funny. First throw, Zachary. It's crazy. Uh -huh. Let's see what else we got in here. How old are you? I'm 37. So you'll be 56 in 20 years and I'm 29. Yep. And we'll come back here and be like, I remember that chair. I remember that chair. Why do you get the stuff, but I, I don't know, get right? the stuff? You know what it was? It was just a little further out, I think. 
Look at that. Um, I don't know if we have anything here. We might actually. It feels like I might. But Probably it's hard to tell. Sometimes you feel like you have something, and then it's just seaweed. Okay, let's see what we got. We have a nail, maybe. Oh, yeah, I, I saw that, yeah. No, nope, just a twig. Oh, a twig. How does a twig stick to that? Yeah, nothing. Nothing on that one. Alright. Alright, let's do a little maybe over the floor this way. Push the anchor! Honestly, though. Ooh. So far, so cool, though. I mean, the chair. Guys, when we got the chair, the look look at him. He is a grown man. And it took him so long to get a chair out. And the, and the weirdest part about it is that it was folded. Yeah. And it took him a while. Can't wait till we... Oh, we got another fishing lure, guys. Oh, yeah. shit. Another one. Looks very similar to the other one. Yeah, it's like. Just be careful, the hook is right there. Who? There's a hook on it. Okay, guys, could I. Uh, where's the other fish? Oh, it's right here. Alright, guys, look at this. Whoever needs fishing lures, we got a couple. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe, like. Yeah, look, guys, look at, look at how similar those are. Right there. A little, like, weight to weigh you down. Look at that, guys, it's a fishing weight. Um, little piece of. Little piece of metal. Right here. Piece of metal. It's like a green piece of metal. Let me see that. I've had a green piece. Like, you know what I mean? Like painted green. Ooh, that's that, that's cool. Yeah, that. definitely. All right, let me clean this off. Hey guys, so I just clean this off from all the mud and stuff that it has on it. Yeah, it's a little like fishing weight. Yeah, look at that. Oh, that's that's, yeah, creepy. Oh, that's kind of weird. Right here now. Alright right, guys, here's the cleaned off second piece of that green thing. Well it's not hard enough to get some uh sweet stand. Alright guys, we are back from lunch. Uh, we had wonderful McDonald's. It was awesome. Yeah, it he had was. chicken nuggets. I had a quarter pound with cheese with bacon. It was great. Anyway, we are in the Frederick Weston Memorial Forest. Obviously, this is part of the Bridgewater Triangle. I don't know if there's any specific paranormal claims in here, but I figured we'd give it a shot. I've never been here before. Oh, that be it's a new intention. place. Yes, um, we got to do some new intentions. What, what, um, what do you want for the first intention to be? I think we'll do paranormal. Paranormal again? again? All yeah. right. That's because you see the Bridgewater Triangle is one of the most known haunted places. That's right. That's right. And this is part of the Bridgewater Triangle. So, so let's do this. Let's do it. All right. All right. We're gonna go. Into the well, yep. We're gonna app. do up. Yep. Pull our app up. We're gonna get a point, and then we'll get our own journey. Okay. All right, guys. We got our first spot. We had to try it a couple times in order to get it, but it's right in the forest. Yeah. We're, both we're gonna excited. check the lake because that's what one of the spots were. It was like literally in the middle of the lake. So like, I feel we got like... the magnet with us too, so we'll try the magnet too. Yeah, know? I have a weird feeling that when it generated in the lake, maybe something's in there that we don't know about. Yeah, you never know. Let's find out. Yeah, let's go, guys. All right, let's go, guys. This has been a long video. Yeah, right. Like I said, I've never been over here, so. Yeah, this is a very new for and, both of Yep, yeah, and I don't think anyone's been over here. There's no cars here. So I don't think there's anyone here. Yeah, it's just us, guys. It's just us. We got some litter bugs, though. Guys, don't hear from us anymore. You know, something bad happened. Yeah. <laughs> Pack of cigarettes, a couple beers, cans of beer here. All right, let's see. I think, yeah, this place is a pretty cool place. Yeah. Our point if it's in the forest since our intention is paranormal again i feel like maybe it could be siren head possibly 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 so anything's you, possible if any of you guys know what siren head is then just make sure to remember that siren head likes to live in the forest that's right at his favorite place because he blends in so Trust me, maybe it could be. Maybe, just maybe. Yeah, you never know. Could be. That's just a theory. I feel like I hear water, but I just I know it's just the wind. Yeah, yeah. the wind is strong today. The water's like all the way over here.
We're just trying to look for a path that goes that way. Yeah, to the left. Yeah. Which this one might loop around to the other side. I feel like one it does. One that gets us like closer to, to the where lake, our point right? is. Yeah, right. exactly. A little closer to the lake, not because our thing is at the lake. We're gonna check that out because we got it in, in the middle of the lake. So yeah. maybe we should have stuck with the lake one. Yeah, right. But we don't have boats. So. Yeah, that's true. And I don't think I can throw the magnet out that far either. That's yeah. for sure. It wasn't exactly in the middle of the lake. Yeah, I feel like it was more on the other side. Like, it was, it was still in the lake. Yeah. yeah. Still deep. Yeah, water point. What if it's a Jason Voorhees drowning? Yeah, it's a cool little forest, though. I'll say that. Quiet in here. So anyway, guys, I just want to point this up. I see this name a lot, like on graffiti and stuff like that in different spots. So it must be an explorer type individual. But um, anyway, um, just found a couple picnic tables here. Um, the water's down here. We were going to see if we could get down to the water. Possibly. Maybe throw the magnet in or something. Uh, oh, no. Guys, I think that was Siren Head. I'm was it? <laughs> All right, let's see. Oh, maybe not. Oh, you know what? I think it's just like a little river. Yeah. See, it's down there, I think. Um, let's see. We'll go this way. Yeah, it's like a... Oof, that would be terrifying. Especially in Massachusetts. It's like the last thing I'd expect to see. In, in Florida, crocs can go pretty yeah, I think they have alligators down there. Yeah. Alligators. They have alligators and crocs. Yep. They don't have camions or gavinals or whatever they're called. Yep. Camions are down in um, South America. Oh, okay. I don't know where it's like a form of alligator or something? It's a type. It's part gotcha. of the crocodilian family. Yep. I don't know why they didn't mention so all crocodiles as a type of the crocodilian family. Dude, like, how many tell me have you seen today? At least ten plus? At least. Fallen? I know, right? Or going ahead of us and knocking down all these trees ahead of us? Probably just came here because he probably did not even know that we were here. Imagine there's a future version of us here. And oh my god. already got him. And right. he's in our... I got scared, I got scared. I don't know why. I don't know why. I just got scared. I honestly have one really bad feeling Yeah? I don't know why I didn't do it. Hmm. Wonder what it is. I don't know why I just didn't do it. It's really because anything... Wait, didn't we say we were going to go back to get to our point? I was, but this goes left, so I was thinking maybe it would take us closer to that. I'm going to pull up the map. Alright, so we're, we're pretty much on track. The, our point's like this way. We'll keep on going where the trail goes. Hopefully it'll loop back around. What was our intention, paranormal, right? Yeah. If we find Siren Head, I'm like. That would make this video, man. That's honestly, for sure. Honestly, all we have like, just send the footage to Nicole, have her do the stuff, and be like. It's, I get, I oh go my one. god. What is with all these trees being broken? I know, right? Like, Tons just, of them. You know what? I'm, I'm just saying it. Our, our intention is just Siren Head. Yep, that's right. Paranormal. I know. You think someone made that? Okay, we are definitely in the Siren Head forest. Right? Like, honestly. I think someone made that. Like a little teepee, it's like a teepee kind I don't of think, thing. Yeah, like. You know what I mean? Like, like, obviously, the tree like, fell, but. Oh, yep. Yeah. And if anyone's watching, it's like a movie of a bunch of episodes of the Siren Head Yeah. So Is there like, something like this in here? Yeah, there was something like that. Really? Someone definitely made this for sure. It's like a little hangout. All right, I'm calling it. This is Siren Head's Forest. Silent Head's Forest. Siren, Siren. Siren Head. Yeah, interesting. I mean, def like I said, someone made this for sure. Yeah. No doubt. Guys, guys, can I tell y'all something? Siren, Siren Head's Forest confirmed right here. What, you want us to capture footage of Siren Head? Real, the real Siren Head? Sure. Come here. Yeah, right? 
Oh, that's definitely that's interesting. Yeah, we're getting. We got to be getting there. We're getting close. Is that? Is not the sun right there, but like the cabin with the blood all over like the roof and stuff. I'm calling it. It's a sign. Interesting. All right, let's see. We'll go around this corner. I'll pull up the map again, see how close we're getting. All right, so our, our point is down here in this little thick area, but it's also within the radius of this little structure we just walked past. So our intention was paranormal. So Zach's thinking that this is our point here. And it's, and it's, a, and it's, a, it's a siren head, siren head hideout in our home. Mm. So like this might be Siren House Forest, you know? Mm-hmm. Could be. And like I said, definitely interesting. Like I said, def someone definitely made this. This is probably like a Siren Head Shrine, so don't so guys, don't go crazy if you start hearing Siren Head All right. Yeah. Weird, huh? Maybe we'll do another intention. Sure. Guys, my next two intents. I have one, they're both the Kevin Anderson monsters, mm -hmm. but next one we're doing is Siren Head. Imagine guys if like the Siren Head, like like a Siren Head dot is like right behind us and then like we see it like moving and then we can see him, we scream and then he like disappears. That would be weird and creepy. Well actually we're also gonna try another Kevin Henderson creature. I don't know, but I know we're definitely doing another, I'm definitely gonna try another one. I don't know which one, I'm picking between the two. It's either gonna be Long Horse or Cartoon Cat. Oh, interesting. Long Horse is a good guy, so if anything, just in case we have Siren Head, I feel like we might should do, you know. A positive one. Yeah, a positive good guy. Mm hmm. Guys, if, if we're doing Siren Head, we're with friends. We're gonna. Maybe we should do long horse first. Then we should do tired head. Okay. Like if we actually find long horse, that would be good. We say long horse come with us. He comes with us. We say then we do sign head and we'll say if that's actually an intent. And then we find tired head and we have them duke it out. I love it. Then we have battle. And then and then that's awesome footage. Now yeah. guys, I'm not saying this will actually come true, but it's just a theory. It's all just a theory. That's right. This is how I'm gonna. That's how I, I'm gonna plan it for this. So if we start, to, if we do long horse and it becomes an intent, if we if we hear bone cracking noises, then we're near. Interesting. Then when we do siren head, then we need to listen to siren head on it. Imagine if we do their intent and it summons them. That'd be awesome. Yeah, that'd be wild. It's right up above this hill. Oh. Some branches. Huh. Ooh, jeepers. Mm -hmm. oh, what do we got here? What? Look at this. Lost item. Egg. Egg and then like a Native American uh, Native. dream catcher. That's what that is. That All could right. be a lost item too. All right, guys, we're gonna do our next intent, which is Long Horse. He is one of the many known Trevor Henderson monsters by French Canadian artist Trevor Henderson. There we go. So, guys, we're gonna do our intent. Hopefully, it actually works. If it doesn't, we tried. Yeah, we'll do a different intent then, I guess. No, what you guys will never believe this. It actually worked. Long horse is somewhere over there. Back, basically, back, back where we came from. Yeah, yeah. Basically. So we, we at least think if it's, it's probably if, if it's not him, it's probably gonna be something to do with him. Maybe like a summoning thing. Yeah, we'll see. And we'll get long horse. Then we'll do siren head, so. and we'll get them to fight for the awesomest, most best YouTube video in the world. We're on our way. 
All right, on our way down. Something to do, maybe with Mongoose? Maybe, wait, does this thing actually, does it actually read your mind? This, how this app works is uh, you have your intention and then your intention goes to a quantum computer in Australia, which generates a random number and that random number generates to a location, a GPS coordinate in your area, whatever the radius you set, you know what I mean? So, um, and then it gives you a point to check out in that area. Question. Yeah. How does it know what your, what your, is? What your intent is? Yeah. Good question. Some some people think that the app listens to you, so it can hear your intention. Oh, um, you know what I mean. I don't know if that's true or not. That's probably why. That's probably why you whisper it. That would make sense, honestly, if it listens to you, just to know what you're intending. Mm-hmm. Not for anything else. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just exactly. Just the intent, like. Yeah. Right. What you're looking for. Just what you're looking for. <laughs> so, if anything, the, the reason we did long horse first is because. We're doing, we can't do Siren Head first because then we'd be dead bait, so. Yeah, right. So if we did Siren Head first, we'd be dead bait, so you have to really do long headers. So that way he can help us out. Yeah, so that way he can be like, this is Siren Head, my flat hand is Siren mm-hmm. Head. This hand is Long Horse. Nice. Long Horse has defeated many of them. If we're going to do Siren Head, we need Long Horse, I'm telling you. Come on, let's at least try. For me, it won't really matter. For you, it's definitely... Careful, bud. Alright. Alright, what do you see over there? Um, I don't know. Anything? Any, anything that would be evidence of long, long horse? There's a skull? A tree looking... Uh, oh, a tree that looks like a skull. Yeah. Um, I'm pretty sure that's what it is. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
the the map. Yeah, the map. All right, it looks like this is going. Is that an animal? Yeah, it was an animal. Dude. Scared you, huh? Yeah, it scared me. I wonder what it was. Probably a bunny or something. Wait, you're recording? Yeah, I just started. Yeah, I don't know what. A bunny or a squirrel or something. The weirdest thing about this sign head, the weirdest thing about the sign head intention is that the fact that it actually showed up. That's the weirdest part. Yeah, right? Like, that's the like, scariest part. That's, that's just making me nervous. The fact that we could actually see him. Oh. Yeah. Alright, guys, so we're getting near to the. Points. We might actually see Siren's head. We don't know yet. The most, as I said earlier, the most creepiest part about it is, is that the Siren head thing actually works. Yeah, right? It gave us a point and everything. And close by, too. And I feel like the best view is like the 0 0.5 thing. Yeah. Yeah, it's a wider, it's a wider yeah, angle. Yeah, like that seems more kind of adventurous for stuff like Siren Head. Yeah. So maybe we'll try that. Just we feel like that we'll do that. Uh, Alright guys, so Siren Head. Get back to our house safe and sound. That's right. Alright, so we'll keep on going. you guys don't need to really worry about us. Yeah, we'll I think. Get back safe and sound. That's right. Right, right. Maybe we'll find evidence of him. Yeah. Alright, let me pull it up again. Alright guys, we're getting pretty close to where the waypoint is. So I think maybe we'll walk a couple more seconds and then we'll check it one more time. Alright, let's check it one more time. Alright guys, we've reached our point, uh, Siren Head Point. It's literally like pretty much over here. There's a little Zima bottle right there. We honestly don't know. Could this, could, could any of this? Yeah. Could any of this be his domain? Literally. Look at that, guys. That's does literally. this look like Siren Head's area? It definitely does. Where Interesting. There, where there's big 40 foot fallen trees, yeah. you can find a Siren Head. For sure. No, seriously. Pretty cool. Pretty interesting. There's a snake in my boot. There's water in your boot. Siren Head, are you here? He's a Let's see. pretty big creature. Yeah, right. We definitely see him unless he's hiding he's, somewhere. He's not like a, uh, what's it called? He's not a spirit. Yeah, right. I was just seeing if he had any uh, supernatural powers. Yeah, yeah he can that. hack stuff like that and like... Oh, really? Say stuff into it. Yeah. Oh, okay. Let's see. Barometric pressure. It's like a 10. EMFs are kind of low. Siren Head, if you're here, use your hacking powers. He has hacking powers, huh? Like hacking your phone and stuff? Hack, hack this dashboard and say something to us. Davis. What? Davis. A name? David. I mean, Siren Head. Who's Davis? Hmm. Is Davis here? Weird. Well, I definitely said something. Davis, what were you killed by? That's weird. Very random. And we'll just walk around this area, see if anything pops up. Yeah, we'll just walk. See if Davis follows us. That's, that's what he is. Mm. That's who that spirit is. Davis, all we want to know is who are you killed by? Or what were you killed by, Davis? That's all we want to know. Stop. That's the first time it's ever said that before. That's weird. Why do you want us to stop? That's weird, huh? 
Yeah, that's weird, huh? Yeah, we should try and get back. You want to go back now? Yeah. All right. We'll, we'll still try. We'll, like, talk to Davis on the way. Right. Yeah, let's talk to that's yeah. That literally, that's the first time that word's ever come through. Speak, speak. <laughs> yeah, Davis. Yeah, we are speaking. speaking. Davis, we just want to know what killed you. Can you tell us, please? I know you want us to stop talking about it, but just please. It's all we want to know. What if he was just died of old age, maybe, or sickness, or something? You know, maybe he lived on this land or something. You know? Are you related to Frederick? Frederick Frederick Weston, right? That's the name of this park? Yeah. Maybe he's like a relative or something. You know? Hmm. Are you a Native American Indian? No. Good question. Yeah. If he died, and he says siren. (laughs) Nah. Siren head. Like, can they, like, mash two words together like that? I don't know. In this app, I'm not sure. But it, or can they only say one word? I think it's only one word responses at a time. Walton. Walton? He's related to Walton. Davis Walton. Is that your name? Or is that somebody else, maybe? All together, you know? Davis Walton. Or Walton... Yeah, when we get to the car, we'll take your boot off. I'm scared. Honestly. I'm so scared I feel like I could cry. Oh, don't worry about it. No worries. All right, well, you want me to shut it off now? What are the words that we... No, let's keep us here. What are the words that we said so far? Uh, first one Marie. was... Marie. We're just getting names. Marie, Walton, <laughs> Davis... We had speak, we had stop. Let's come on. Let's go. Bunch of names. I'm having a feeling. So I'm having a feeling. What if this is Siren Head? He's trying to stop us, he's trying to make us speak. Hmm. He's naming the people who's killed. Oh, interesting. Good thought. Yeah, Good nah, thought. Nah. Interesting. Uh, if Siren Head does exist, that's what he does, right? Yeah, he hmm. could say that. He could, he could be like. Lawyer. Lawyer? Are you, were you a lawyer? Or are you saying Zach could be a lawyer? Uh-huh. <laughs> Siren, if that's you, honestly, thank you. That's yeah, right? A compliment. Yeah, right? Ooh, Absolutely. We're heading out of your forest, honestly, if this is. Yeah, we had a good time in here. It was fun. Say yes or no if this is your forest. If you're Siren Headed. What is the name of this forest? What's my name? Nothing. Orb. Orb. Where is an orb? Orbs are like balls of energy, people say. Yeah. That's interesting. And that's words never come through either. All these words have never come through on here before. That's what people say. That's what people claim. I don't know. If th- I don't know that for a fact or not. Well, technically, if you think about it, they it's are. just yeah, it's just energy, I guess. Really. No, I'm talking about like ball. Not oh like yeah. Mm-hmm. Spheres. So that's a ball of energy. Because like, an orb could, doesn't have to just be called a ball of energy. Right. It could. It could be dust too, or insect. It, it could be called insect. a sphere. Energy, yeah. That's true. Let's keep this on just in case Siren Head is like nearby. And this is Siren Head saying stuff like that. Huh? Just keep it open just in case Siren Head is going to be attacking it. Are you Siren Head, Davis? I mean, are you Siren Head? Say yes or no. I think we lost them. Mm-hmm. I think we so. Lost that All right, I'm gonna shut it off now. All right, guys, what an incredible video. Um, definitely some creepy vibes towards the end there. We got we do use the um, the word bank thing. Yep, 
you use the ghost app on the walk back we just heard, to see what happened. We heard Davis, we heard Stop Speak. Yeah, Marie was Walter. another one. Walt, um, was it Walter or Walton? Yeah. Walton was another name. Bunch of names came through and then Stop and Speak, which is kind of interesting. And lawyer. Lawyer, that's right. That's right. Yeah, that was the last one we heard. So I feel like Siren Head was like naming, since he can hack into stuff, I feel like he was naming the people who he killed. Interesting. Like Anything's sense. possible. Anything's possible for sure. Yo guys. Yeah, you do. Do you have fun today? Mhm. Mm Yo guys, we did not. We didn't find what's the name Siren Head, Lord. but we might have found evidence of him. You know, you never know. We did get a point. We did check it out. And we also did not really discover anything. We didn't discover anything with the red and not a cap, sadly. Yeah, not too but too we much. Still had Fishing, we did have magnet fishing. We found the chair. We Thank did find um, one lost item or whatever. I don't know if it was lost necessarily, but it was like the. And um, you guys did see the uh, what's it called the ASMR part of the video. Yep, that's true. That's true. Small little part. Well, anyway, guys, thanks for watching this video. Make sure you like and subscribe. Hit that like button on the bottom. Also, storefrontier.com. Get yourself a nice shirt. And what else? What else? What else? Uh, make sure you guys subscribe to the YouTube channel, and then. Uh, you went and tied only on the. Shop That's right. Fishing. The fishing item. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We got a couple um, lures and stuff like that. So if you know that sort of thing, hit us up. We'll, uh, we'll definitely tell you what we found. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching this video. Peace.